This is going to be a quick tutorial on how to check your aircraft and mounting. Now first off you're going to go to your program and you're going to click aircraft. Now currently we have it set on a quad rotor X. So that's the type of quad, ro uh, quad rotor we're using for the matrix. Now make sure it's check marked and then you'll see at the bottom there's motor test. You, you can click motor test and click agree. Again make sure that the propellers are off and you'll see that it'll give you selections of M1, M2, M3, M4. So if you click them, you'll notice that your quad starts spinning. Depending on which one you click, M1, M2, you'll see that the motor will spin. You want to make sure that the motor is matching the direction it's spinning on the diagram. So if M1 is spinning counterclockwise, M2 is spinning clockwise, M3 is spinning counterclockwise, and M4 is spinning clockwise. Once you verify that, that means you're good to go. If for any reason it's not spinning, um, you might want to check some of your other settings, which we'll go over in further tutorials. So, um, now we're going to go to the mounting. Mounting, um, again, you just want to make sure that everything's okay. Um, you can make adjustments, so based off of centimeters. Um, so I believe our default settings is negative 3, negative 5, and negative 10 for the Z. If it's red, you'll notice that um, it's not loaded. So as you can see right here, it says press enter to write. So make sure you press enter, and when it starts turning black, that means it's fully loaded into the flight controller and it will record it. And that is how to uh, use your NASA MV2 assistant for the aircraft and mounting.